Welcome to Guns, Guns, Gear, and Guns with Gary Gunderson. I am Gary Gunderson, and I come to you with some good news regarding steel-cased ammo for your AKs. Most of you watching this are already aware of the Russian ammo ban, the Biden administration punishing Russia for some light poisoning by banning the future importation of ammunition from Russia. This ammo is a lot of the cheaper steel-cased stuff on the shelves, and with ammo still scarce has really impacted the 2A community more than dear old Putin. However, it appears Palmetto State Armory is going to try to fill this vacuum by bringing the manufacture of cheap 7.62x39, 5.45, and 54R ammo stateside. I've seen a few people posting it around Facebook for the last day or so, but the biggest one I saw was reposting a post from Atlantic Firearms saying the same thing. But I have also found some forum posts from someone associated with PSA that always seems to have legitimate information about upcoming releases, so I think this is more than just a rumor. The post indicated that they have been in this process for a year already, but the first rounds may not come off the line until 2023. And of course, with everything going on right now with supply lines and shipping, there could be further delays since this is a large-scale project. This news is of course very good for everyone in the AK community, where people have wondered if they'd have to buy expensive brass to feed their rifles, or maybe decide not to buy an AK platform at all due to the potential lack of cheap ammo. You know who you are. And if they bring these traditionally Russian ammo lines into steel-cased production, maybe they can fill the gap for other calibers as well. There will be a market for it, after all. However, to be a pessimist here for a moment, I do think steel-cased ammo made in the U.S. may never meet the prices we have been used to. I mean, it's Russia. They probably send workers home some days with a vodka and a pack of cigarettes. With American manufacturing costs, I don't think we will get the $5 Tula box. I think if it were so easy to keep the costs down and meet or beat the prices of the Russian or Eastern Bloc import ammo, someone would have done it already. That makes me think that we may have a cheaper option than any US made brass AK ammo you find, but nowhere near what I am used to as a purveyor of cheap ammunition. Then again, maybe I'm wrong. Maybe they'll fill that gap perfectly and keep the costs down. What do you think? Will you give domestically produced AK ammo from Palmetto a try? Do you think they can get the price down anywhere near imported ammo? Let me know in the comments. Please like the video and subscribe to the channel for more content. Thanks for watching.